The former chairman of President Donald Trump's campaign will spend nearly four years behind bars. Paul Manafort was sentenced to 47 months in prison for tax and bank fraud related to his work advising politicians in Ukraine. But as Fox News correspondent Lauren Blanchard points out, Manafort still has another sentencing hearing next week. Judge Ellis saying he didn't need anyone's approval for his decision. He only needed to satisfy himself, sentencing Paul Manafort to 47 months in prison. He made clear he accepts responsibility for his conduct. The judge said he hoped the case would serve as a beacon of warning to others attempting to hide money overseas and avoid paying taxes. But he thought the 19 to 24 year sentence suggested by federal guidelines was, quote, excessive for this case. Manafort was convicted on eight counts related to his tax and financial crimes. The judge ruling the sentences could be served concurrently and that Manafort would get credit for the nine months he's already served. Manafort was red faced and emotional as he was read the decision. This after the former campaign chairman for President Trump spoke to the courtroom for about five minutes, asking the judge for compassion, adding, saying I feel humiliated and ashamed would be a gross understatement. But Manafort did not tell the court he was sorry, a surprise to the judge. Manafort's current living situation also came up in court. The 69-year-old has been living in solitary confinement, which Manafort says has caused his health to suffer. Lawyers say it's for his safety. Manafort also requested he be sent to a federal prison in Maryland to be closer to his family. Manafort will also have three years of supervised release following his prison time. Next week, Manafort will be sentenced in D.C. on a separate case where he faces another 10 years in prison. In Washington, Lauren Blanchard, Fox News.